know, my expectations are to uh, come in here, roll up my sleeves, work hard, uh, and just see what the men and women at Bell Helicopter do on a daily basis. Uh, you know, my goal is always to first of all find out, you know, what's going on from the, again, from the perspective of the employee, uh, but then to also, you know, understand what are some of the challenges to running a business like Bell Helicopter as well. So I can go back to DC and tell and share with my colleagues, hey, here's what's going on in, in the American workforce. We've got the honor of having Congressman DC here. Uh, it's wonderful uh, to come here and work with you today. Uh, really the, the best defense contract workers in the, in the country right here uh, in Fort Worth, Texas. I appreciate everything that you're doing for our country to uh, give our men and women the best possible uh, edge and equipment uh, that they need uh, while they're out uh, in service. One of the reasons why I wanted to come to Bell Helicopter is that, uh, you know, uh, really uh, uh, aeronautics and defense is really a big part of the North Texas area, in particular uh, the Fort Worth part of the district that I represent. Uh, someone once told me uh, that uh, you oftentimes hear Fort Worth called Cowtown, uh, but you probably really should call Fort Worth Airtown uh, when you think about defense and when you think about what aeronautics has, has meant uh, to the development of this city, the growth of this city, uh, you know, jobs, economic prosperity, uh, many of these uh, defense jobs in particular that we have, like at Bell Helicopter, you know, unfortunately, we would love to always be in a time of peace, uh, but we have a lot that's going on overseas right now. Uh, we're probably going to have a lot that is going to be going on around the world for quite some time, uh, and, you know, making sure that we get the very best for our men and women uh, in uniform, I think, is, is critically important. Uh, the one thing that I learned here uh, at Bell Helicopter, I would say, is just how a, the, the pride that people have uh, in their jobs. Uh, and again, you know, it was, it's, it sort of re-emphasized to me just how uh, important it is to, to be able to have a good education uh, and to make sure that I'm going back and that I'm re-emphasizing that when I visit with local educators in my district.